Hey, what is up everybody? How you doing today? Boy, do I have a fun video for you guys. I hope, hopefully everything goes to plan. This was a lot of work to set up and I really, really hope you guys like this. It is kid friendly. So if you have any kids that like this type of, type of stuff, this will be totally fine for them. So here we have 50 robot vacuums. Yes, 50 all in this one area. And we're gonna have them all go at the same exact time. And above them, we have 10 confetti balloons that I'll be popping randomly throughout this video. So it should be a cool spectacle. Each one has a ton of confetti, so when it explodes, it will pop and get all over this room, therefore making a mess for 50 robot vacuums to clean up. So I've been thinking about this idea for quite a while. It just took so much time to set up. So I'd really, really love if you guys could like this video and subscribe if you like this. It would really help me out and I would really appreciate it and I'd love for you to join this channel. Here's another view from the top. This will be mainly the view you'll see. And like I said, randomly throughout this video, I'll be using certain items to pop these balloons and it will lower confetti all over this place. Probably on top of the robots. It might even get into these lighter systems. So hopefully I don't ruin any of my robots, but What's the point of having 50 of them? You can't have fun with them, right guys? All right guys, so once again, this took a very, very, very long time to set up. All of them should be charged. And I'm gonna, in a minute, just hit go on all of them. They all should go and bump into each other and just drive all over this area. And then they will have a nice mess to clean up as we go through this video. So I think I'm gonna have two versions of this. One where I kind of speed all this up and then I'll put another version down in the description where it's gonna be the full video. And I just hope everything goes as planned because I really only have one shot at making this work. Because if some of these work and some don't, and the batteries get low on some and the others are high, it's just a pain to get this many to cooperate. So let's have some fun. Let me know in the comments if you like this idea before we get started. And like I said, I'm just going to hit go on all of them. Hopefully they all go. I'm, I'm highly doubting that all 50 are just going to work perfectly. So you might see a couple just sit there possibly. I don't know. But uh, let's get started. Hopefully you guys enjoy this video. All right guys, how y'all doing? So this video is very tough to edit because there's so many different clips and stuff I want to show you guys. So in about a second now, you're going to see a real quick minute and a half kind of time lapse of the entire cleaning job. Then right after this time lapse, you can see it in normal speed where all the cool things happen. And let's just say not everything went as planned. Definitely some mistakes, some... Uh, some problems and not every robot was functioning right but overall still a pretty cool job I think and uh, hopefully you guys will enjoy the rest of this video please like and subscribe it really does help me out and uh, can you say drone failure enjoy Here is one of the problems I used or was planning to use a little BB pellet gun to shoot these balloons and the pellet went through so fast that it just made a quick hole in it and this is the air escaping it. So I had to think quickly and you'll see in just a little bit 
what I used to pop a few of the other balloons. A couple of the balloons did pop perfectly fine with the Pelican, um, but then I had to switch over to something different. And I went good at first, and then you'll see it kind of, <laughs> kind of went kind of crazy. So. So yeah, here as you can see, <laughs> the the drone hit one of the lines, and it just completely entangled. One of the propellers was st not spinning anymore, but the other three were going crazy, and there was no power off button that I could find. So I didn't, I was kind of panicking here. I didn't really know what to do, and then it started going crazy, and I caught on to another line from a different balloon, and then eventually it gets all the way over to the light switch line and all three are tangled on three different props. And uh, yeah, it was, it was pretty crazy. I really wish the camera was a little bit higher and you guys could see it, because it was swinging like crazy, which you can kind of see there, but yeah, just one of the things that happens when you do these crazy tests, nothing ever, ever goes as planned, but it does definitely make for a more interesting video, if you ask me. And then here, there's so many, so much commotion going on that it ripped up part of my uh, trim to separate the carpets. And uh, yeah, this was a crazy test. 
it, it was fun though. Let me, hopefully you guys are enjoying this. All right, we have round two for the drone. There's one more balloon left in the back that unfortunately you can't see. So I'm gonna go pop that, fly the drone around and kind of spread all the confetti around so the robots can clean it up better. And then I try to land on one of the robots just for fun and, well, let's just say I miss. Alright guys, so I'm trying to land it on this silver chopped vacuum. A little bit harder than when it's moving. And in my defense, this drone is uh, not the best drone. But uh, yeah, the vacuums got a little bit tired of them flying overhead and they decided to take it out. So Pretty funny and if you ask me, I definitely didn't plan for that. And the vacuums just kind of have their way with it for a little bit. And then I think I get it to take off one more time after they beat it up. And, uh, yeah, it, it fails again, sorry. Uh, yeah. What can you do? everybody thanks for watching that I really really hope you guys enjoyed it obviously this was just for fun uh, this is only 50 of my 70 plus robot vacuum so if there's anything crazier you want to see definitely let me know that on the comments also these guys ran for about an hour and 20 to hour and 30 minutes total let me know if you guys want me to upload the full video that's uncut and you guys can watch it from beginning to end along with all the mistakes that were made and uh, yeah, it was fun to do, a lot of work, but I like doing these types of videos for you guys. So before you leave, please do me that favor, like and subscribe, share if you want, and uh, definitely leave a comment below with any ideas you might have or any test you want to see with any of these robot vacuums. I'll try to make that happen for you guys.
Thanks so much for watching again, and y'all have a fantastic night. See ya. Thank you.